Hi, I'm Jerry James Stone. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make a delicious persimmon, pomegranate, and quinoa salad. I'm gonna go over what's the fuss about quinoa anyway, plus also which kind of persimmon should you be eating. It's a really simple salad. It just screams fall. I think you'll really love it. So let's get to making it. So the first thing we're gonna do is roast our pecans at 350 degrees for about five to 10 minutes, just until they're nice and toasted. Okay, those are looking good. Let them cool now. Okay, so we have our arugula. I'm gonna add our olive oil to it. Add some balsamic vinegar, some salt, some cracked pepper. Add in our toasted pecans now that they've cooled. Add our pomegranate seeds in. Add our cooked quinoa. So quinoa. There's a lot of fuss about it. It's like this, you know, hip fad right now. It's been that way for a few years. But actually, quinoa is hella legit, people. Like, quinoa is super high in protein. And it's one of the only plant-based proteins that has all of the amino acids that our bodies can't make. So that makes it super tasty, super good for you, and you should be eating it. Let me show you why. Add in our persimmons. Okay, so in this recipe, I'm using Fuyu persimmons. There's basically two types of persimmons that are grown commercially here in the US. You have fuyu and hashia. Fuyu persimmons, you can just eat them like an apple. Like, cut off the stem part, just dig right in. Hashias, you definitely do not wanna do that. In fact, if you've ever been into a hashia, you know exactly why. It has like this, it has an ingredient in it that just makes it like, it feels like pins and needles in your mouth. It's just really unpleasant. It's best for baking. If you have a hashia um, persimmon, what you wanna do is you just wanna let it get really, really overripe to the point where it's almost like a sack of jello. Like it's not something you wanna bite into. So that's the difference between those two. Now I'm just gonna mix this together. The reason I'm doing this before I add in the beets is because the beets are gonna get everything red. So I wanna just not mix those too much once they're added in. So get all these ingredients worked in. Such a colorful salad, right? The orange and red from the persimmon and the pomegranate. Now in and our beets. Here's a little fun fact about beets. They were actually nature's like first Viagra. The Romans actually believed that beets were an aphrodisiac and they used them in that way. And they might have actually been right because beets are really high in boron and boron is what's used to help produce the human sex hormone. So hey, there you go. Eat some beets, get horny, it's all good. And just lightly toss it and it's ready to serve. So there you have a lovely beet persimmon salad. It just screams like fall produce. It's just wonderful to look at. It's super tasty, easy to make, high in protein from that quinoa. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And hey, you know what? If you like to cook like I do, then please subscribe. I release new videos every week. And if there's something that you wanna see, drop a comment below. I'll see you guys next time.